Thank you, Mark. A Stark County mother under arrest after her social media post sent officers scrambling to an Alliance school. As News 5's Bob Jones reports, students were told to shelter in place because of a threat police took very seriously. The concern here at Northside Intermediate School started around 9 o'clock yesterday morning when the principal was shown a screenshot of a disturbing Facebook post, a mother threatening harm to the school. It was, I think, a pretty high level of concern for us. Anytime anybody threatens, you know, to blow a school up or anything up, um, you know, we definitely take it seriously. The 30-year-old mother is facing a felony charge of inducing panic. We're not naming her to protect her daughter. Police say on her Facebook page she wrote, I'm walking. I'm blowing down that expletive school. They expletive with the wrong one. Another post claimed her daughter was a victim of bullying. Alliance schools have failed and I'm coming to raise hell. The safety and well-being of all of our students and staff is our first priority. So um, if you make a threat, um, we have to take you at your word. Several officers rushed to the school and Superintendent Jeffrey Talbert says all students and staff were told to shelter in place for three and a half hours. The school day continued, but no one could enter or leave the building. Dash cam video shows the mother being arrested at a house on Linden Avenue, more than two miles from the school. Talbert says the district monitors social media and he's thankful the school was alerted to the threatening post. I would encourage everyone if they have an issue um, with the, the how their son or daughter are being treated in school to reach out to that school principal. We have procedures in place that, that will help. Um, social media is not the spot, spot to get a response. The superintendent says there's no evidence that bullying took place at the school. And Stark County Children's Services says the agency took custody of her five children in December after she was charged with child endangering in a separate case. In Alliance, Bob Jones, News 5.